Hello friends. I hope y'all are having a great night. We are going to have our Fun Folds card class tonight. And we're going to make three cute Fun Fold cards. We are going to have one that folds out like so. Let's see how that folds. Very cute. And we're going to have a card that actually can be a card or a gift card. It's a cool little fun fold. So cute. And our third fun fold. Let me see where that joker is. Hmm. I don't see it. Oh, it's right behind my camera. That's why. Hi, Terry. Here's the third fun fold. Ta-da! It's a little, little turtle. So cute. Awesome! So, we're going to make these three fun fold cards tonight. I'm so happy you joined me on our online card class. So, of course, I do come to Facebook every Wednesday night for a Facebook Live video, and we make lots of fun projects. I'm so glad you join me each week, and tonight is a special night and because I, because I think they're super fun. So, I hope you enjoy it. Keep in mind, when we have online card class, we have a special night because you can... When you put in a $35 order, you can receive the card class in the mail. So be thinking about what you want to order and get that order in um, by Monday because that's the deadline for ordering for the online card class. So you'll get the cards in the mail shipped to you for free um, with a $35 order. And while we're talking about it, if your order goes over 50 then you're going to get um, a package of the Be Dazzling, two, actually two packages of the Be Dazzling uh, paper, this sparkly wonder of paper. And there's eight sheets in each package, so you'll get 16 sheets of this 6x6 six six paper. Or if you already have enough of that, you can get five free cards that I'll choose for you. All right, so welcome Patricia. Good to see you. And who else do we have? April is here. Terry is here. Susie is here. I'm so excited. All right. Y'all ready to get started? Let me point you down into my craft space and we shall get started. All right. Hello, Kathy Brown. Good evening. Good evening. It's always so fun to see all my friends on Facebook on Wednesdays. So keep in mind, we, we have Facebook Lives every Wednesday, but like I said, today is a special night because we are making fun folds. We're going to make this turtle fun fold. We're going to make this um, giraffe fun fold and this sailboat fun fold card. So I'm sure you've noticed there's a total absence of Christmas. I'm ready. I have lots of Christmas things to craft, but I'm also ready to move on and do some other fun things. In my card class, I thought we would just, we're already doing 12 days of Christmas. Every day at noon, we have two days left. You, If, if you've missed any of my, hi Ellen, if you missed any of my uh, total days of Christmas, you can catch all those videos here on Facebook. Thank you for sharing. Hello, Kathy and Ellen. I love it when you guys share my video. More people can watch, and the more that watch, the more fun we have. So let me show you. Let's get started on one of our cards, and then we'll talk about some things. Okay, let us start with our little turtle card. He is the cutest. And we're going to use this stamp set called Turtle Friends, okay? What I love a lot about this stamp set, thank you, Sharon. What I love a lot about this stamp set is the happy birthday 
and the belated birthday because to be honest, I swear most of my birthdays are belated. Um, you are totally loved. And then you've got this, it's time to celebrate. Hello, little one and forever friends. So you've got a very versatile set. Turtles are great for girls, boys, the whole nine yards. Um, and we took it one step forward and turned it into a fun fold. So, and the fun, the other amazing thing about this stamp set is that it's a bundle, okay? So we love a punch bundle. Quick and, quick and easy is what we like, all right? So you can see the item number is right here. The stamp set itself is only 16. The bundle is only $30.50. So put that on your order and grab some stamp and seal refill and you'll be good to go. Get your class for free or get all the stamp sets. <laughs> Turtles are so like you, Kathy. You're so silly. I love it. All right. So I can be slow on some things and I can be quick on some things. It just really depends what it is, I suppose. I'm really slow about cleaning. It's just not my not my jam. All right. So we're going to uh, keep in mind when you are on my email list, you will get all these um, PDFs for free. So make sure and join my email list. The information about that is on my face is on this Facebook. So first what we're going to do is make a background using just jade and just jade so the colors we're using tonight if you want to do these cards later are just jade night of navy flirty flamingo and bumblebee so i got the idea for this set of colors from the sweet symmetry designer paper which is we're going to use in the other two cards but it's the cutest set of designer paper and it's um, it's monochromatic on one side and then it's cool, cool flower patterns on the other. So I've used so much of it. This is my, probably my third pack. I'll show you some of the other patterns. There's a monochromatic blue pattern. Um, there's a flirty flamingo. So I love the colors in this paper. I just think they're so cute. I love them all. Love them all. Anywho, you want to pick that up. It's a great paper for all year round. All year round. All righty. Let us... Let me set this catalog over here for a minute. Might need it later. Okie dokie. So we're going to stamp Just Jade. I, I pulled out of the stamp set this the little... Um, streamers and you know this could be a birthday card but this could also be like any celebration so graduation um, and you could just use the it's time to celebrate and that's all you would need now you don't have to re-ink your inker every time in fact that gives the illusion that some of our streamers are in the foreground and some of them are in the background so just re-ink at will just have some of them going off the edge just for making it look real and I believe that's good so we're just kind of creating our own in an effect our own designer paper there we're going to use oh, we're going to use the in symmetry paper for the rest of it but um for this card I wanted to do oh you're right Kathy that would be a great new year's card fantastic it's time to celebrate I love it I think I shall do that. Okay, so we're going to adhere this little piece down to, and all we're using is a five and a quarter, five and a half by four and a quarter piece of Flirty Flamingo here. I love this Flamingo Jade combination. I think it's so cute. All right, now this is where our fun fold comes in. So we're going to adhere this little piece and when you're making fun folds you've got to get out your bone folder because you need a good sharp crease on your folds that way it'll lay flat okay and we are going to go ahead and stick that down 
And when it's when it's got all this moving part to it, I'm going to go ahead and put this tambin seal all the way around and stick that down smack in the middle. Okay, and that's going to create our little fun fold. All right, now we're going to stamp some things on here. We're going to stamp our cute little turtle. Yes, you could stamp and color him. You could stamp and punch him. I chose the simple route. When we do card class, we want to keep it simple because I want you guys to, to be able to make these at home without any stress, okay? So we want to keep it simple and fun. Simple and cute. Oh, wait, I almost did that twice. So turtle here. And then on the other side, we are going to stamp a, some party hats. First, we're going to get the party hat on the turtle because he's at a birthday party. And since it's photopolymer, you can you can look right through there and it goes exactly on his head. And then I just added a little schwingding to the middle of the card here. Just something for fun. And then you can go ahead and stamp the happy birthday. Or this could be a New Year's card. This could be a graduation card, whatever. We're gonna make this a birthday card. Ooh, that's not very pretty, is it? What shall we do? What shall we do? Let's do some Just Jade birthday hats. There's always a way to conceal our extra stamping that gets on our cards. Ta-da! Okay, so now we're going to use this flirty flamingo with one more stamp from the stamp set and it says it's time to shell celebrate and that goes right in his shell and it fits perfectly because stampin up is awesome and oh goodness gracious now we're just going to stick our happiness into our card so slide your inside in and then adhere your outside. And we're going to get some ribbon. Now, none of the ladies in my class had ever seen this ribbon before, which was fun. It is just jade and gold ribbon. It's from the annual catalog. So, let me see if I have it marked. I don't think I do, but I'll show you. Um, there's so many pretty ribbons in our annual catalog. So, don't forget about our gorgeous ribbons. And this is just the Just Jade Gold Braided Ribbon. It's only $6, which is a great price for ribbon. All right. So, we are going to slide it in to this little fun fold section. And you'll have just enough in your packet to tie a knot um that that seems to lay more flat and it's easier to do because remember we're doing things that are easy in card class not torturing ourselves all right i love how it frays too it's really cute but i am going to choose to cut it at a sharp angle you could fray it out if you wanted to all right so fun fold number one that's it okay isn't that cute and simple you could make so many cards in a flash it's not even really that much harder it's just super fun hi mom mom came to card class yesterday so she was the lucky one of the lucky live participants in my class so i'm gonna stick this to the side all right now I want to tell you about something exciting and that is our what's coming up is our happiness and rainbow and happiness bingo so I'm gonna give you a sneak peek of some new products that are coming I think these this this paper would be so cute with any of these cards that we're making tonight but it's got happiness sunshine and rainbows and you guys when Christmas is over we're going to need some sunshine and happiness, either because we got a little bit overdone at Christmas or maybe Christmas is hard for you. 
Um, we're going to bring sunshine and rainbows on January the 2nd. So make sure and register for the bingo party. I put emails and um, Facebook posts all about it on on my information today. So go join, sign up for that. You will love it. Plus you get to win prizes. Um, that's if you live in central Arkansas. Let's do card number two. We're going to make this cutie cutie. Oh, I got to show you a couple more cards using the turtle set. This is a little baby card. So adorable. And I just colored, I colored that with the granny apple green and stamped that with granny apple green. Okay. So you can see there's a little shell stamp. And same here, I colored that with Granny Apple. I actually used the punch here and stamped that with Granny Apple and then stamped that with black. So you've got your little punch that punches out your turtle. All right. Now let's make our next card. And I see this as a graduation card primarily, but also if you have a friend that just went through a divorce, if they are going to college, if they are just starting something new that's a little bit scary, then this is a great card, okay? So, and it's a fun fold. You've got your scale boats going all the way out. I love that it gives the illusion of movement. I love a card that says that it's moving, okay? So we're gonna start with a standard sized card that actually you're gonna score it the standard way and then score it again at two and three quarters. That's really it. And this folds this way and then back that way. So you're gonna, and that's this fun fold. Like y'all, I'm serious about these fun folds. They're cute and simple. Okay. Now this is where we're gonna pull in some of our uh, in symmetry paper that I showed you about, some of that designer paper. I like this pattern. It's a monochromatic pattern and it's just really gonna correspond really well with navy. I love just jade and navy together. We know navy is a neutral, right? So we can put any color with it. But look how cute this would be too, this designer paper, okay? So that's one of the patterns in the sweet symmetry. We're gonna use our scallop contour dies to cut a little front here. And I'm going to go ahead and stick that down. Remember, only put adhesive on one side of that so that it doesn't glue your card shut. Okay, and then it opens like so. All right, now what we're going to do is we're going to do our stamping. So we're going to stamp a sailboat with navy. Oh, I forgot to show you the stamp set. It's called Sweet Farewell. So you're going to either uh, do Bon Voyage, Will I Fit in Your Luggage? It's not goodbye, it's just see you later, or this is the beginning of anything you want. Um, and then there's also Promise to Keep in Touch. I love this is the beginning of anything you want. That's my favorite of the sayings there. So we're gonna get our little piece of basic white. And this card only uses Night of Navy ink, which makes it super easy. And that's just gonna go smack in the middle. Voila. And then we're gonna take these two um, sailboats and put them on either side, just to make that fantastic. And then we're gonna open this up and our sailboat is gonna come here, it's gonna go across the edge. It's gonna go down off the edge. It's gonna come back up and it's gonna end up going off the page. So do you see it implies movement, which is awesome. And we're gonna stick this little section here like so, and then we're gonna tie a small piece of just jade ribbon around this. So what do you guys think so far? Do you like these cards? Do you see yourself making these cards? Are they simple enough for you? 
simple and cute is key. So I love these stamps. They are all, I forgot to mention, they're all in the annual catalog. So that is the best place to look for fun stamps. And I had, I've used a lot of my stamps from the annual catalog, but I also challenged myself this month to use three sets that I had never used before. So these are sets that were just in my sweet stamp, sh stamp shelf that hadn't gotten any love yet. And they're perfect. They're perfect. We want to be ready and to hit the ground running um, when the new year starts. And I love to give cards as gifts. So you could make a set of cards for a friend, wrap it up in a nice pretty bow, and that could be a Christmas present. So how about that for a Christmas present? All right, isn't that great? And I'll show you another option for the card that you could do. And this is one where I just use the Bon Voyage while I fit in your luggage. And you can see the roller bag is going um, off the edge of that. I know I love how you fold cards in so many different ways. Thank you, Ellen. Is the ribbon in the annual catalog? It most certainly is. It's right here. Just Jade and gold braided ribbon, one fifty five eight one five six dollars on page one thirty nine. Super cute. And everyone at Glass was like, "I haven't seen that ribbon yet." It's just it doesn't necessarily um, come with any specific suite. So sometimes when they don't go in a specific suite, we don't see it as much. All right, now let us move on to the third card. And this stamp set has been around for um, for a year, and I have I didn't get it, and then it continued in the new catalog, so I definitely got it. It was one of those, I don't know if you ever do that, you just kind of play chicken with the stamp set, and you're like, I'm gonna get that stamp set, I'm gonna get that stamp set, and then you don't, and then you finally get it, so. And I had it, and I just still hadn't used it yet. And I saw it, I saw it, and I just thought it was the cutest. So it's called Back on Your Feet. And it's got all these cute little critters. It's got a sloth, a turtle, and a giraffe. It's a lighthearted thinking of you set, which who doesn't need lighthearted when we're thinking of people, right? Chris, I know. It is really cute. I love it too. Um, I love a good funny set that takes a bad situation and makes it good. <laughs> um, who, what friend that opened this would not get a smile, right? Even if they were un un going, undergoing the worst of circumstances. My friend Paula Bobbitt had knee replacement surgery. Whoever wants to have an operation? No one. So I'm going to send one of these cards to her because I think they're precious. All right. So let's get started on this one. You've got a, a white card base and we're going to use the, on this one, either white or thick, regular white or thick white, it doesn't matter. Um, and then I've got another of my favorite pieces of this um, in symmetry. You can use this pattern or this or this pattern. Either way, I'm going to go with the flower, you know. I think I'll go with this one. And we are going to pull out a, some Just Jade. I love this Calypso Coral with it. And then also a piece of Bumblebee, just for good measure. All right. Now, this is our base of the card. This is just a standard five and a half by four and a quarter piece. And we are going to put our designer paper down to it. And we'll go ahead and put down our Calypso Coral just to get it out of the way. It's just gonna be right there in the center. All right, now this is how we're gonna make our fun fold. So this is going to fold up, and this is going to fold over. Mm 
Okay, so actually, sorry, this folds up and this folds over. My apologies. All right, and so also, it's nice to have a little notch here. So you can use a circle punch, but I also was going to show you how to use this, um, this punch. I don't even remember what it's called. We'll have to look it up. It's maybe called Label Me Lovely. I can't remember, but it makes, makes a nice little, um, little divot there. And I'm going to see what that's called. I love punches. They're quick and quick and easy, quick and easy. Yep, label me fancy. One fifty one two nine seven. Um, really, anything that's kind of rounded. If you have an older circle punch, we don't sell any anymore. You could punch. That's how I did that with a little circle punch or even a circle die. So let us pop this. We're gonna just gonna pop this bumblebee piece in here. It just gives it a little bit of. Oh yeah, the bumblebee is pushing too hard. Don't push too hard with your seal like I just did. When you push too hard, bad things happen. All right. Now we're going to take some glue dots and we're just kind of building the inside of our card here. And I chose to just use a glue dot in the edge in the edge corners edge corners here because I want to be able to pull a gift card in and out I'm trying to see if I can find my Starbucks card but I had one floating around here but it's it's um, stuck into one of my cards but anywho a gift card fits perfectly in here it's so cute you look a little bit harder for it Oh, maybe this is it over here. Perhaps. Yay! All right, so you can see it actually matches perfectly for a cute little pick-me-up, okay? And who doesn't love a gift card? You could also use this with Christmas colors and make a Christmas gift card, of course. All right, we are going to stamp this with just jade. So I'm going to use the hope things get better soon. Hope you're back on your feet soon or hope things get better soon. Let's put hope things get better soon for this one. And we're going to use the just jade. I think I already said that. Ta-da! And while we've got that ink out, we're going to stamp the this is not good. So cute. Oh my gosh. And we're going to stamp our giraffe. And it's going to be in Bumblebee. Now, I love these cards because we're stamping with just a color and we don't have to color it in. We could, but remember, we're keeping it simple because it's card class. So the giraffe is going to go a little bit off the bottom edge here. And he's finished. Isn't that cute? All right. So let me close my inks here so I don't make a messy mess. Now what we're going to do is we're going to... I'm also, since there's some moving parts here, I'm just going to put adhesive all the way around the four edges. And that is going to get stuck down like so. Okay. And if you wanted to not make it into a gift card holder, you could trim this bumblebee piece down a smidge and just pull that in and out and let that be like, let's pretend like this goes in this way. And, you know, just write on the little bumblebee piece and you could write a little note to your friend there too. Okay. So on this one, you can write right here, you know, whatever you're going to write. Don't have to write much at all. So. That's it. I can't believe we made three fun fold cards in 30 minutes. Super cute and simple. We've got our turtle, our giraffe, and our either our sailboat or our luggage that's going off into the distance. All right, let's get some get some information here. 
Turtle Friends, that's the order numbers for your Turtle Friends, either the stamp set or the bundle. Why would you not get the bundle? You need them both. Uh, the Sweet Farewell is the travel-themed set that we used here. And we have Back on Your Feet with the animals and all the twisty situations. The Sweet Symmetry Designer Paper with all the pretty cute patterns is here. Remember that a $35 order, you'll get the free set of the cards um, to make. So you'll get the packet to make the cards in the mail. Free shipping. And if you order $50 or more, you can choose either the two packs of Be Dazzling paper or five free cards. So this is the Be Dazzling paper. Um, I'll remind you that tomorrow at noon, we'll be having our 10th, 11th day of Christmas. You also can find a link in this Facebook post to the last chance list. Please uh, don't forget to sign up for our bingo if you live in central Arkansas. And um, join my email list so you'll get the free PDF instructions. I can't think of anything else. Does anyone have any questions? Oh, if you're watching this video on YouTube, absolutely subscribe to my YouTube channel because... You will see videos every week, so you won't want to miss a single one. All right, friends, thanks for joining my online card class. I'll send out these PDFs on my email soon, and we will see you tomorrow on the 11th day of Christmas. Bye.